Well, Eric, it's really the moment we've all been waiting for. Cruz gave us a big thumbs up this morning around 1140, saying they had found that time capsule in a heavy covered box in the place they thought it would be, the northeast corner. The 1887 copper time capsule is finally spotted. Nice job, guys. Pulled from the rubble that lies where the Robert E. Lee Monument once stood. We talked to construction superintendent Michael Spence behind the gates. So you've got this large 3,000 pound plus capstone and we slid that to the side and immediately my company owner, Devon Henry, went stop. Every, and I mean, everybody stopped. Different from that other lead box they found last week that held books and other stuff they thought could be it. Largely disappointing, I think, right? Everyone kind of shrugged. Spencer Sherry made it a point to stop here on his trip from New York to Florida when he heard the search was back on. I know that they were talking about Lincoln's some shot of Lincoln in his coffin or something like that, and that just struck me as that would be a, an important American thing to attend. Historian Dale Brumfield says he can see why they put that picture of a dead President Lincoln in there. This is the thumb in the nose of Lincoln in the north, putting them in the bottom of the statue that's dedicated to the glorification of this marvelous almost deified Confederate general. Conservator Kate Ridgway bubble wrapping the capsule, telling us the governor's office will take the lead on when it'll be opened. Now, crew spent a little more than four hours out here looking for that box today, and it was found in acidic water, but they took it right to the lab immediately after they pulled it from the rubble. For now, live in Richmond, Sabrina Shutters, 8 News.